eight pounds of russet potatoes for $9.98. That's nuts. <laughs> little tiny thing of maple syrup they disguise it as a bourbon bottle they charge you ten dollars for it ten dollars for maple syrup that's crazy <laughs> oh my gosh look at the cereal 648 holy cow 648 648 well it says mega size what's oh, more like mega price oh my gosh $39.94 for one dow I mean 40 bucks it's it's as nuts it's crazy it's plastic Look what I found. One single pie crust, just like this. $3.88. I mean, there's just one in here. $3.88. Are you kidding me? That's nuts. $5.86 for some jarred asparagus. I'm sure it's fresh. <laughs> well, today is Thursday. We're in front of Walmart here. And uh, I got to get some supplies and... Uh, for uh, this weekend, my wife is cooking up, she cooked up uh, last weekend uh, a chicken stew and it was just delicious. And so I'm gonna get me, uh, I'm gonna get some uh, potatoes, carrots and vegetables and then we're gonna go and check prices. So uh, let's head in, let's have some fun. I tell you, it, this is Thursday and, it, and it's, I just checked the temperature and it's a balmy 93 degrees here in, in uh, central Florida. All these moly, it's hot out. <laughs> it's bright as can be. We get, we always get the afternoon thunderstorms in uh, starting around May and June, and uh, uh, they'll be starting up about three, four o'clock. But uh, we're heading in. Well, as we head into Walmart, I noticed that they have the watermelons here, and check this out: four dollars and sixty-seven cents. Holy smolies! Look at these guys. They say you can tap them, but listen, there's one there. They all sound the same. <laughs> But they have a lot of them, and they're $4.67. They're cheaper than the flea market. Wait a minute. I see a... Oh, here, these are $6.72 right here, the big boys. $6.72 for these guys. Holy smolies, that's a big one. Looks like a big pinto bean, doesn't it? <laughs> $6.72, but I'm impressed. They've come down in price. Well, it's the season here in Florida. That's why. And, and as I come in here, here's the ice, $2.33. And, and look at this, it's a seven pound bag of ice. You can hold it with, you can hold it with one hand here. Seven pounds of ice, and it's $2.33. That's just, just ridiculous. I mean, it's ju it just, it's just water, it melts. <laughs> well, it looks like the grapes have gone up $3.28 a pound. They weren't that much before. I thought they were $2.48, but the grapes have gone up and uh, they're not too bad those are the red 328 even for the um the green grapes they look nice though they look nice but 328 a pound oh my gosh let's go check all oh, the plantains oh they look a little overripe 42 cents <laughs> they eat a lot of these plantains here they're really good and uh if you fry them up in brown sugar and uh, butter oh they're really good but what i came here for is a couple of baking potatoes my wife's putting together a, a chicken um, a stew, like a soup, a dollar eighteen per pound for these russets, and I, I just need two of them. So I'm going to look for two nice ones here, and um, that's all we really need. So let's get a couple nice guys here. I'll take oh, I'll take this one, and I'll take this one. Looks good. So two of these guys. That's all I need, and I need a pound of carrots. So I'm starting out my list here. Acorn squash. This is good. $1.28 a pound? That's not bad, don't you think? That's really good. You cut it in half and put brown sugar and butter in it and bake it in the oven. Oh, man, that's good. What else do they have here? Oh, that's butternut squash. No, it's acorn squash. It's butternut squash. $1.28 a pound. I don't think that's what's from Honduras. That's traveled a long way. <laughs> and spaghetti squash. Oh, that's what they use to make the spaghetti. $1.52 a pound. And I'll have to look at the flea market what that was, but I didn't see any of this at the flea market when I was there. But sweet potatoes. Um, oh my gosh, that's a monster. Whoo, jeez. 98 cents a pound for that. Holy smolies. 9.98 for eight pounds of russet potatoes. Holy cow. That's expensive, you know. My gosh. That's insane, right? $10? Holy cow. Oh, the potatoes have really gone up. Seven ninety-seven in in nine ninety-eight, four ninety-eight for these guys. Holy cow! Five sixty-eight for white potatoes. What's going on with the potatoes? Idaho potatoes. 
five pounds is five thirty-six, but they're they're really small Idaho potatoes. Uh, usually in Idaho they're huge, they're monsters, but five thirty-six. Eight pounds of russet potatoes for nine ninety-eight. That's nuts. <laughs> Well, I was told to get some carrots, and I noticed that I'm looking at uh, organic broccoli is 366. I don't see it. I guess it's this head right here, 366 for that monster there. Look at that! Holy spoilies! And and what is this organic asparagus 396? That's a little crazy right there. 336 for organic zucchini. I mean, <laughs> oh my gosh, that's really pricey right there. And where are the carrots? I was told to get some carrots, a pound of carrots, 98, 98 cents for a pound of them. So all I need is one. And um, I know they're not organic, but they're whole carrots, fresh and crunchy carrots for 98 cents. And that's what I'm going to get so far. That's what I got. <laughs> but what else do they have here? Oh, a green, no, oh, celery right here. How much is celery? It's $1.84. $1.84. There's hardly even half a stock in here. Look at this. I can wrap my hand around it. And it's and it's a dollar eighty-four. A dollar eighty-four for this. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. And these prices on the sweet onions haven't changed a dollar twenty-eight, but I, I got I bought four of these at the, at the flea market there, the farmer's market. Four of them for two dollars. Two dollars for four of them. And this is probably close to at least a dollar's worth right there. Then the red onions, a buck forty-eight, they've gone up. And, and it was the same, you get four of them in a basket for, for $2. Now that was the deal. Here's a garlic sleeve, $1.84. $1.84 for this, and it says it right there. Garlic sleeve, $1.84, holy spoilies. <laughs> now here's these little, perso per they're called personal watermelons, <laughs> and they're four twenty eight. Now what makes these, what makes these any different than the ones that are three seventy six up front? I, I just don't know. And a honeydew was four forty-eight for this guy. Five dollars for this. Holy schmolies! And what are cantaloupes? Now they're big, but they're three dollars. But four twenty-eight for this guy. Look at this. That's not very big for four dollars and twenty-eight cents. Holy cow! Unbelievable! And what is this? A golden honeydew, four twenty-eight. Oh man, the price of fruit. I tell you, and vegetables is just crazy at, at the regular stores, not the farmer's market. Now, here are some of the Walmart's box pizzas that used to be $5 each, $8.20 for this little pizza now. It's eight, it's eight twenty, dollars And this one here is just a medium pepperoni for $6.94. These used to be about $3.99. $7.84 for the large, extra large, and then extra large. Eight forty-four, nine sixty-three for the large, seven dollars for a medium, and five eighty-seven for this extreme extreme bacon. Ooh, I bet that's healthy, right? <laughs> and and um and oh, oh, oh reduced. I hate to see anything reduced and buy it, but oh now I found your five-dollar pizzas. <laughs> Here they are. There they are right now. They're tiny guys. Five eighty-seven, five eighty-seven for them. Eight twenty for this. Eight dollars and twenty cents. Everything's just oh ten dollars, ten dollars for the extra large. Holy smolies! Now you know I have to get my bread, and I look for the dates five twenty, five dollar forty seven still. But I see some that's a dollar seventy eight. I think it's going up, so I'm gonna get a couple of these guys right here. And I like the sliced. I really like it. And I put it in the freezer, and uh, it's really good bread. It's really good toasted. And I like the price. That's the best thing about it. And I've had these before, these great value, and they're they're not bad at all. These um these cones right here, which are um I can't get them out. Look at this, you can't you try and get something out, you can't. There's eight cones in here, they're five thirty-six. Here we go. Five dollars and thirty-six cents. That's not too bad. They're actually pretty good, even compared to the Nestle. And and I like them. I bought them before. Get in there, guy. But um, and I don't know how the Ice cream sandwiches are, I don't see the price, but oh, look at this, they have the small fat boys. <laughs> 472 to try these guys. I'd like to try some of them. I'd be hooked, oh look at this, cookies and cream. That looks really good, I like them. <laughs> I don't like this though, that's pricey right there. And when I was at Sam's, I bought a bunch of uh, club crackers and I bought some brie and 
I put some olives on and I ran out last night so now I have to buy some of these pimento they're $2.48 for this little tiny thing and it's $7.12 for that so I don't know what to buy here what's what's a good price this looks like it's the only one that's affordable I don't see I don't see much of a selection and I'm not gonna spend $12 on that because the 33 cents 43 cents an ounce but I don't think I need all those and look at the price on these guys 598 and then this is 334 oh my gosh 334 594 594 594 I bet these are really good but the price isn't 594 5 594 oh they're superior colossal holy cow look the price is colossal <laughs> oh here's some Here's some for $3.34 stuffed. Man, I tell you, everything's just the prices are still staying high. As I was looking for olives, I just saw this olives to go. I've never seen these before. I mean, I've seen fruit cups to go, right? But $4.96 for these guys. Olives to go, I guess. <laughs> I've never seen that before. The snack you can pack. Oh, kosher dill uh, petites, but olives to go. Never seen it before. Oh, look at this. Oh, here it is. Oh my gosh, you get a, a pickle and a pickle in a pouch. The port's called the portable pickle. Three dollars and twenty-two cents. Here's another one. Pickle pops. Two ninety-two. What the heck are these things? Oh, you freeze them? Oh, that's got to be delicious, right? <laughs> that's crazy. It, who would ever buy that? And, and the price three twenty-two. Are you kidding me? Oh, look at this jarred asparagus. 586 586 for pickled asparagus five dollars and 86 cents for some jarred asparagus i'm sure it's fresh <laughs> now i found some different olives and and they're quite different in the price with the pimento in them they're 498 for this seven ounces and if you want it without the pimento it's a dollar 88 but i i want it with the pimento in it and now this one says stuffed at a dollar 50 and i have to look to see if if it's the same, by looking at the number on the back, and it says it's a dollar zero four four. You got to be careful. See where it says the dollar the zero four four matches the barcode, and it says these are a dollar fifty. So I'm going to get these, and um, I, I I hope the price is correct. It, it just seems different. Why is this a dollar fifty, and this is four ninety eight? I mean, it looks like it's the same thing, right? Let's just check. Let's four six is the barcode on this. And this one says four six on there, so I don't know what the, the difference is. This is what I mean about you gotta you gotta shop right stuffed with minced pimento. It looks identical, so I'm gonna try this and see if it's a buck fifty instead of four ninety eight. So I'm gonna put this in the cart because this one was two forty eight. So I'm gonna keep them both in here and I'm gonna find out which one is the correct price because yeah, I never trust anything here. Well, the owls are, were right. They were $1.50. I can't believe it. It's the same thing. Holy smolies. They're probably expired. <laughs> I'm just walking down different aisles, and I, I saw a pie crust shell here, and it's $1.26 for the great value. And then when you look at the Keebler pie crust, one single pie crust in here, 10 inch, is $3.12. $3.12. Are you kidding me? $2.94 for one of these. 294 for the 388 for the oh it's gluten free <laughs> look at this gluten free 388 for just one of these do you just get one is that all you get in here you only get one you get one of these guys holy smolies and 348 nut pie crust walnut pie crust i can understand 348 for that but i just can't that's that's okay there it probably doesn't taste any good but but to buy this one gluten free 388 and 294 for just one of these that's crazy look at this look what i found one single pie crust just like this three dollars and 88 cents i mean there's just one in here 388 are you kidding me that's nuts oh my gosh look at the cereal 648 holy cow 648 493 holy smolies only 298 but it's great value 628 378 for fruit loops 448 448 598 648 well it says mega size what's oh, more like mega price oh my gosh 
it's just cereal's really gone up. Just it's nuts. I don't know what's happening, but oh look at a buck sixty-four magic treasures. Ooh, ooh. I see the treasure is when people buy this. Who when Walmart makes out? Oh my gosh. But five ninety-eight for cocoa pebbles there. Look at the little box. This is a tiny little box for three forty-eight. That's the mini box. <laughs> the price isn't mini though. But five ninety-eight for that. And oh look at look at the tricks. The tricks is getting you to buy it. That's the trick right there. Holy smolies. Four forty-eight. Four forty-eight. Six twenty-eight. Oh my gosh. Cereal's just nuts. Oh, here's here's some crazy prices on syrup. Uh, Mrs. Buttersworth's here. Four dollars and twelve cents. Three thirty-four. This is this is just nothing but high fructose corn syrup. Then I saw these crazy prices here. Parker's maple syrup for seven thirty-two. Look at this little guy. Eight eight ninety-seven. And here's some amber color. They make it look like a whiskey bottle for nine ninety-seven. Look at that. It even sounds like it. It's glass. Hear it? Listen. Yeah, it sounds like a whiskey bottle. <laughs> oh my gosh. Hey, whiskey's even cheaper than this, but that's crazy. Six eighty-two for this. 832 for that. My gosh, some of the prices on this just crazy. Let's check this out right here. Crown. They call it crown. Isn't that booze, right? Oh, bourbon barrel aged maple syrup. This little tiny thing of maple syrup, they disguise it as a bourbon bottle. They charge you ten dollars for it. Ten dollars for maple syrup? That's crazy. <laughs> Well, I've been looking into, since my dogs are seven and, and going on nine years old, to buy them some new dog food. And some of this wilderness is my favorite, Blue Wilderness. And this is four pounds, and it's twenty two ninety eight. And when you look at this now, I look at, at Amazon, and I have an Amazon delivery. Uh, a warehouse right by is $51 for this. It's 13 pounds. Now, I can tell you, this is some of the best dog food on the market. But 13 pounds for 51 dollars is just insane i have to hold this up because i look at it at pet supermarket and it's it's a hundred dollars for this it's a hundred dollars for uh 24 pounds 13 13 pounds of dog food here now this is good dog food there's no doubt wilderness this is some of the best you can buy but it's 51 dollars for 13 pounds we'll just times that by by two that'd be 102 dollars for 26 pounds it's crazy it's just nuts dog food is super expensive i mean you have to take care of your your dogs and i have two labs and they have beautiful coats and they're healthy but this is the price you pay everything is sky high it's crazy i was just passing by the center aisle here because i'm going to automotive and i look look at this 39.94 for for one doll here 39 dollars and 94 cents for one doll i mean this is crazy $39.94 for one dowel. I mean, 40 bucks. It's, it's, it's nuts. It's crazy. It's plastic. I just wanted to go by the tooth, toothpaste dial and, and look at the crazy prices here, but two 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 things of toothpaste. It's a, it's a value pack for $9.96. A value pack for $12. $12.96. One of these is $5.96 for Colgate. Holy cow. You get 3.2 ounces value pack here 846 one of these 497 496 for this i can't believe this is 996 this this is this is ten dollars for this it's called a value pack <laughs> and then what else do they have 796 optic white removes 15 years of stains that's a lot of years of stains right there what else do they have whitening strips sensodyne for one of these 692 692 12 12 dollars and 48 cents are you kidding me must be a two pack it's got to be a two pack here it is it's a twin pack it's a twin pack 12.48 oh look at the value that's a value pack 17 dollars 8.97 3.97 for one of these toothpaste 4.97 you know how expensive it is to go to the dentist look at 8.97 12.97 i get all this at, at sam's club it's a lot cheaper $4.97. This is the cheapest you can find it. Holy cow. Look at the prices. It's crazy. It's just nuts. $17, $12, six, six ninety-two. That's seven dollars for just one. Something here is $49.59. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and $69. Oh my gosh. Let's look at the toothbrushes now. $9.96, $5.96, $7.96. 
Oh my gosh, oh it's it's an Oral B 1497. Holy smoly! My gosh! Well now this is this is a little bit better. 1697 if you're gonna be using toothbrushes like this. But um, I use one of these uh, Oral Bs right here. That's what I use. And the heads are really expensive on these. Look at the price of that. $25, $39 for the Oral Bs, $29, $16 for you get what you get three heads in there for a replacement. Very expensive to brush your teeth. I just can't get over the price of this. Twelve dollars and forty-eight cents for uh, for a <laughs> for a two uh, tubes of toothpaste, and you have this right here. This is um, this is seven dollars for one tube. Seven dollars for one tube. Holy smoly! Well, well, there is my shopping haul right here. I got some under herb deodorant. It's only two dollars for this, but I'm gonna price these two olives and find out two forty-eight or dollar fifty. Which one is right? Uh, my loaves of bread, and I got a sunscreen was which was eleven dollars that's not too bad i want to get that for the forerunner but uh well that was my shopping haul for today and just had to get a, get a few items for uh the weekend and uh the olives i'm gonna price those olives when i get to the register and uh, you know one of them is gonna be wrong because everything is usually wrong when it's in the wrong spot i just don't believe a lot of the prices but i hope everybody enjoyed the show give me a thumbs up for like don't forget to hit the subscribe button until next time this is scott with the real economy we'll see you